please suggest best manner of meditation for me. As we have indicated to the entity, there must be some ceremony. Choose whatever manner that befits thine own consciousness, whether this is from odors or otherwise. And if odors are chosen, choose sandalwood and cedar to be burned. In such an atmosphere much of those things that were a part of the experience through those periods of meditation may be brought back. Then surround the self by thought, as well as by word, with the consciousness of the Christ presence. Then, and only under such, ye may open the centers for direction. Please suggest affirmation well to be kept at this time. O Lord, our strength and our Redeemer. In the Christ consciousness I come to thee, as thy handmaid, seeking thy promises and thy directions. Use me, O God, in such manners and in such ways that my life may reflect the love thou hast shown to the children of men in the Christ life. And may I ever be a channel of blessing to others. I did some thinking and reason that Christ exemplified to the world the divinity of man. And the process by which man in this upside-down divine, material, form became possessed for and of himself of this divinity. My message constitutes this explanation and to accomplish this, I must merely be the vehicle for such an expression or explanation by the one who is my authority, the divine power or father, for such expression. For then I may, like Christ, claim him for my authority. And also like Christ demonstrate the truth of this to those who have the mind's eyes to see and hear. That is understand and gain for themselves a consciousness of like divine relationship. Correct? This, as we see, just that as has been outlined in the various visions. And the conditions that come about before and since these visions. Or this understanding has been gained by the entity, in its body and mental consciousness, as respecting to various phases of consciousness, of mental mind, of the body mind, of the subconscious mind, and of these being one in all and all in one, and in the manifestation of same, as is man's will power, or man's or the entity's power in relation to these same conditions. And how same may be manifested before men, whether that of stocks, bonds, individuals, homes, peoples, monies, cities, or whatnot all being of that one force, in its one way to manifest that divine force, as has been exemplified through the Christ and through the individuals who make themselves one with the Father. For, as is seen in each individual, individual lives as are seen are manifested in the earth plane. Each entity sets that as the ideal, or that as the criterion, and works to that one. And that of the Christ life. God, the Father, made that ideal. And that life spent in manifesting that ideal before men. Same as this entity, 900, may manifest that same ideal that oneness with the Father. And thus magnify that name. As is given. None above or beneath, or in the broad ways may no other, than the Father lives in those who would seek to do his, the Father's, biddings in the earth's plain. It seemed I traveled to a place by Bode, and there beheld the Master. Christ Jesus. I shouted to all about me as loud as I could. We can be like he. I have proved it. We can be like he. I have proved it. None would listen or believe me. I entered what seemed to be a grocery store, and there beheld a man who appeared as Christ. It may or may not have been he, but he was dressed as Christ would have been, but younger. A woman said to me. Isn't he a wonderful God? You can be like he. I answered her. Oh. She replied, you are not like he. You are a soft, mushy human. I turned to show her Christ, and it may have been his picture on a box, I showed her, but there he was, as I knew him from pictures I had seen, an older man, sympathetic, yet unyielding in his faith in the truth, its adherence, and propagation to his fellow man. I went up to the store counter and sat down, and there behind the counter I saw the younger man, like Christ, kneeling down in prayer. He was thanking his father for much. I leaned my head in my hands and cried bitterly. 
it hurts in here. I said, pointing to my heart, and it seemed this referred to my inability to make others understand, and also that he suffered just that way. I said. What is the use of the real, the true, if we are ridiculous to all here on earth? And I saw myself as ridiculously crying my message, we can be as he. I have proved it. Then I saw him again, kneeling down in thankful prayer and crying I said. It hurts to my very soul. Then the voice it may have been his voice spoke and said. They shall return again to earth to learn. They shall kneel down and worship thee as me. This, as we see, approaching that condition wherein the elements of the spiritual entity enter that almost of the holy of holies. Gaining strength and wisdom from him, who is strength and wisdom. And as the vision brings the truth to the entity or body of 900, that whereas he suffered as he cried. Oh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem. How oft would I have gathered thee together, even as a hen gathereth her brood under her wings, and ye would not. Then as is seen, there enter the elements of the physical in that though we may have a truth, and same appears ridiculous. This, as we see, comes from physical or material reasoning. For as the answer comes, this entity must give a message, that those who would seek him, the master, may find him. Often prayer, even as the master, often communication then with him will strength and endurance in body, soul and mind come to him who has viewed a message from him. First, then, so surround self with that influence, mentally, consciously, physically, of his love, his glory, in the earth. Then conquering self enables one to consciously and in every sense meet out to others that given in the experience day by day. Fear not. No. No. He is able and willing to, and lovingly will, guide the way.